as you're ready. I want you to close your eyes. And I'm gonna make funny faces at you while your eyes are closed. No, I'm kidding. Keep your eyes closed. And I just want you to, again, I want you to focus right now just for a second on your heart rate, okay? And as you take that deep breath in again, in through your nose, out through your mouth, feel your heart rate slowing down, okay? Feel your mind kind of coming at ease and, and everything still kind of melting away from this 45 minute push that you just gave, getting stronger. Um, I remind you at the beginning, keeping those eyes closed, to focus on your why. Focus on why you're here and, and kind of going along with that. I want you to pick, when I, when I tell you, um, when I say the phrase, the most important things in your life, okay? Immediately now I want you to start listing them off in your head. I want you to paint a picture, a giant mural in your mind of all the important things in your life right now, okay? Whether that's people that live in your house with you or elsewhere, okay? Whether that's people, whether that's things, whether that's groups, whatever it is, I want you to focus on those things, the most important things in your life. Focus on them. Visualize them in your head, all right? Almost visualize them so in, with such intent, okay? And such ferocity that you can almost reach out and grab them, okay? Or give somebody a hug, okay? Because they're so present there in your mind, okay? I want you to take a sec, visualize, paint the mural. It's a beautiful piece of art that you guys just created of all those important, crucial things in each and every one of your lives, people, places, things, okay? Now that we got that, I want you to open up your eyes. Open up your eyes. Do you still remember all those all those things? And I hope at least one or two or three of them, or 17 of them, made you smile. Because that's what they're there for. Um, but, and I did this this exercise, the mental exercise, um, for myself, and I did this with, with my family. And for us, not one of us chose, picked ourselves. None of us picked ourselves. And I'm gonna guess, again, educated guess, that when I asked you to pick the most important things in your life, the majority of people aren't gonna say me. Because, and, and again, I would expect nothing less of this group here in Flemington because it's, I, seriously, I haven't met like a mean person since we got here like so long ago. Like, it, seriously, it's, and it's, it's a selfless, okay, giving group of people that, um, that just wanna give and wanna, wanna benefit others and help others and, and wanna be there and would give the shirt off their back to help somebody else in need. And that's, that's exactly what, what you guys are here. Um, but taking a step back, those, those most important things in your life, okay, you gotta always remember to keep yourself on that list as well, okay? Because like we always say, you can't pour from an empty cup, all right? Self-care, and I, and I said this when I, uh, when I did the introduction for Brian for the national kickoff, it was that, you know, caring for others is so important today. And you know, our loved ones, the same people that we just thought about a few minutes ago, caring for them and giving that care is like one of the most important things that we can do now. It's one of the most selfless acts that we can do and, and I see it being done all across the board. But the other side of that coin is you gotta take care of yourself. You gotta take care of yourself. You gotta put in that, that little bit of effort, all right, to self-care so that then we can, you know, then pour out of that glass and fill our plate with, with stuff from others. And again, I see nothing but that from you guys here today and the push that you guys gave again, even if it's just 45 minutes on the dot every single day that you guys are giving, all right? That's 45 minutes of fuel to your fire to get you through the other 23 hours and 15 minutes, okay? Every single second that you push, all right? Think of it like another shovel full of coal into that fire, getting that fire burning as bright as you possibly can. You have the rest of your day now, the rest of your day with this fire shining as bright as I've ever seen. Okay, I told you you were up in the ante. I upped the ante and you rose to the challenge. Literally, you rose to the challenge every step of the way. So I wanna say thank you. I wanna say thank you for pushing yourselves. Let me unmute you guys real quick because I gotta hear from you guys. Um, Amy, how do you feel? I feel great. Okay, I can't hear you, but like maybe. Oh, I maybe feel great. Ritza, can you hear me? I can yep. hear you. Okay, I don't I, know why I can't can hear you. Can you hear me? Either way, I want you to put something nice and close to the camera, okay? Gretchen, how are you feeling? Awesome, oh, I love it. Okay, but sometimes close to the camera, we're gonna say take it to the max on three. Thank you guys for pushing yourselves. Thank you guys for waking up with me, I appreciate it. Take it to the max on three. One, two, three, take it to the max. Have a great rest of your day. Thank you guys for pushing with me. I appreciate it so, so much. You guys have no idea. Take care, I will see you guys soon.